Hello, I am in Naperville, and this here is an abandoned, well, I don't think any of you guys have heard of this uh, small little chain, but this was a place called Standard Market, and I've never been in here, but I guess it was a combination grocery store and restaurant, and probably a very overpriced grocery store if that. And I think there was this was only this was only one of two or three in the Chicago area. I forgot where the other one is, and I think it might still be open. I'm not sure, but this one here in Naperville is closed now. For you guys have that that have lived in the area for a long time, this used to be the site of a Frank's Nursery. Frank's Nursery used to sit on this site, and apparently got torn down to build this and. Only for this to close only a few years later. So let's go take a look at this. So over there was a sign that would advertise like their specials and everything. And it was a very nice sign too. Alright, let's go take a look in some windows here. Pretty nice looking <coughs> Excuse me. Very nice looking design here. Yep, unfortunately they didn't make it. You know, the thing about grocery stores is why are certain grocery stores like so overpriced, you know? Uh, food is a necessity, not a luxury. All right. Okay, I guess they put that on a lot of buildings whenever they close down. Yeah, like I said, I've never been in here before, so... Okay, that, that's nothing. Automatic doors there. Okay, there's other windows to look in here, so let's walk around here. Alright. I think this closed like a couple of years ago. Yeah, if any of you guys have like ever shopped in here or been in here, tell me what it was like. Like I said, I've never been been in here, but I've heard this was uh, closed though. Hmm. Interesting. It's like some uh, sinks would have sat right there. I see plumbing hookups and everything, and then some electrical hookups as well. I like the uh, light fixtures on here. Classic looking light fixtures. Huh, no breakfast. Because guess what? They're closed. Join us for breakfast on weekends. Nope. Not today. Alright, so I guess here's the restaurant. The grill part of the restaurant. I kind of wonder if somebody buys this, who's going to take a space that's this big, you know? I don't know. Okay, so here's the patio here. I mean, did they have good food and everything? I mean, Aurora Avenue is kind of a major road, and it sits off of Ogden, but it kind of sits far away from Ogden, and this isn't like on Route 59 or anything like that, so 
I think visibility might have been an issue. Plus, there's enough grocery stores in Naperville. Anyway. And restaurants as well. I mean, in fact, I think there's another chain that's going to be coming into Chicago. I forgot what it was called, but I guess somebody's starting a uh, chain of grocery stores. I'll think of it in a second. I forgot the name. If I read it in a news, in, either on Facebook or in a newspaper article. But yeah, I think the grocery market is already overcrowded. It's a big building. Wow. It goes all the way over here. Holy cow. Better be careful, the police station is nearby. <laughs> I think the landscaping and everything. Yeah, I couldn't drive into this parking lot. They had it blocked off. I guess so that way, like, nobody can store, like, vehicles and things like that in the parking lot. Trucks could tend to use these as areas to sleep in. Okay, I can't reach those windows because of the landscaping here. Nice looking building here. I think a Publix Works is right over here too. Wow. There's more. There's their loading dock that they have to have hidden. You know, Naperville is very picky about how you build your stuff. I think in my travels I've driven by one of these that was still open. Okay, so we're going to walk through a forest here. Yeah, nice. It's like a farm style type building. a bowling alley over there that's been over there for a while let's get on the sidewalk here yeah that's a big building wow interesting I think they had a lot of uh, ready-to-make meals, too. So I remember seeing, like, on their sign, their specials for stuff that was ready to be made. Oops. Uneven ground there. Okay, then some of them windows were too high, so let's go ahead and get out of here. Let's take one last look at this as we come back to the front here. There you have it. All right, then, so from this abandoned standard market. In Naperville, used, the site used to be a Frank's Nursery. If you're not a subscriber to my channel, please subscribe to my channel for a lot more content to come. Like, comment, and share these videos, please. God bless you. Continue shopping at your local businesses. 
continue shopping at your local mall.